<laughs> Today we're talking about polygamy, coping with polygamy. Polygamy is as old as creation itself. Looking at it religiously, in Islam, it is allowed for a man to marry up to four wives. Huh. While in Christendom, it mention was made back in the days of Abraham of some people that had more than one spouse. Oh, yeah. Even in our African tradition, religion, traditional religion, we find that we, we hear of some gods and goddesses that had more than one partner. So it gives us back to the same question. Is it just an African thing for a man to be polygamous or is polygamy really a way of life for every single male? We're going to be talking about the pros and the cons of polygamy on the show and how it affects the couples, the spouses involved, and of course, the children who didn't plan to be involved in the matter in the first place. So I'm going to be starting with um, Aisha. Aisha, do you know anything about polygamy? Were you born in a polygamous setting? Did you find yourself in a polygamous setting at any point in time in your life? <laughs> uh, truth be told, I am from a polygamous home. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Was married into polygamy. Okay. okay. So I, I, I think I know some things about polygamy. Okay. But you see, the same man is a polygamous in nature. Uh, it's just a, a, an easy excuse and, you know, a, a rather convenient way uh, to allow the man his indulge, in, indulgences when the woman cannot be said to uh, be polygamous by nature. by nature. Remember, not too long ago, there was this um, rumor that uh, a certain country had polygamy. Uh, yes. And all the that. men went there. And all the men got so excited yes. that, uh, you know, there are beautiful women in some country where you can actually marry my more mother. than one Legally. that is legal by law yes. by law uh -huh. and that he was you know you will be uh, you will be walking outside of the law if you were a man and, and you, mar you don't one. marry more than one you know it really so, really excited me to think of the fact that almost every single man was happy about it. They were very happy they about were very it. Excited they said that the lines were so long <laughs> at the embassy, but it happened out to be a fluke. And the Asian women are really you know. beautiful women. Too. Yes, they are. So what about they you? Are. Do you have any experiences with polygamy? Um, not, not directly, but of course, if you're going to talk about um, being on the other side of have men and their non-monogamous yes. ways, yes, but... Um, not directly, directly myself, but I have immediate family who's um, been, uh, you know, and it's not all kids from, because there's something that was said just now in the crowd when, oh, uh, not every kid from a polygamous home will tell you they had a bad experience. Upbringing, yes, that's you know, true. Some, some yawls got along. Yes. Like, look at all these Oba's wives and they stuff. They all live together you know, under they, one big roof. They wear the same clothes, they, you know. But that, that is not, um, it's not a alone. parameter for judging yes. whether or not the, the, the setup itself is perfect. I mean, wearing the same clothes and Coming it could be, and it could just outside. be, you know, like uh, what you call, uh, let's put our differences behind at home. And put and, up a show. And put up a show outside. Mm -hmm. You know, it could be that. I'm not, I'm not saying Say, that, yeah. that is what it is. The topic really is coping with polygamy. polygamy. How do you cope with polygamy, yes. Silo? How do you cope with sharing a man with another man? Knowingly. Mother, with another you know woman. I mean. How do you cope with um, the time you want to spend with a man? Uh, and it's not your turn. It's not your turn. How do you cope with the fact yeah. that, you know, you know <laughs> how, just, do you, how do you cope with the fact that uh, you share even uh, to, to the kitchen, you share with it another with another woman. I like to you, cook for my you, man. You know, exactly. So I can imagine so, you wanting to leave Valentine. I mean, it is, how do you cook with something it? something special and then it wasn't my turn to cook and then having to eat something that Omasa cooked for my man. <laughs> <laughs> so, so if you say polygamy, a uh, man is polygamous by nature. The men are also jealous of polygamy by nature. You know, I mean, the, the men, are, women are also uh, jealous of polygamy by nature. The men cannot stand their woman being looked at by another, another man. man. They get so so me jealous. You, you so agree with me? Down. So, so meanwhile, you have yes. left her unattended. Exactly. Yes. yes. Exactly. Yes. And we're going to bring some guests in who are uh, who who have first-hand knowledge of this topic, coping with polygamy. First and foremost, I'd like to invite um, Dr. Bayode Ogunsonwo. Mr. 
Ogunsonwo is a charmer. I greeted him and I told him to sit down, but you know, he, the gentleman that yeah. he is, mm -hmm. he went across. He is a happy polygamist. Okay. He's also and the and a seasoned again? educationist. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're welcome to the show, sir. Thank you very much. Um, sir, you're a polygamist or an advocate of polygamy. Uh, why did you decide to adopt polygamy? It was not intentional. Okay. No. <laughs> yes, it's a, it's a game of chance. Okay. <laughs> It's a game of chance. Okay. And once it is, it is like that, I have to take it like that. Just move like that. Just yes. <laughs> I have to, I have to well, move on. Okay, can you share your actual experience? What happened? Um, actually, when I was in university, I had my first child. Um, um, since then, I've been living alone as a bachelor. Okay. I got married, and my first wife in overseas returned. That okay. is not marrying another person. So, so before I know it... You helped her? Yes, there yeah. are two. <laughs> and uh, once I, I got her back, my, wife, my life was improving. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay, so let, 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 let me understand you. Understand. You, had, you, had, you had a love child when you were in university. Yes. Okay. Uh, this love child, the mother of your love child was the one you now married before your wife, who was overseas, returned? No, no. no. Okay. no I, I married another person. Not the one that had Not the one life. that, yes. Yeah, so okay. that one returned from overseas and said that she's not marrying not another married person. Yet. Okay. Except so, my very self. So then you decided so to marry So the family her. intervened. Okay. It was very hectic, but I have no choice. Okay, but, but by then you had one wife already. Yes. One baby mama, like they call it now. Yeah, yes. And yes. then one returnee. Returnee. Wifey. Yes. Okay. So, so you, all of them, all of them, you yes, accepted all of them. They are now two. It's okay, two. okay, the baby no. mama, he didn't marry the baby mama. No, no, no. No, the baby not. mama was the okay, no. please, uncle. Ed, Ed, no, no, no. You don't understand what I'm saying. No. No. She thinks you have three wives. No, mm -hmm. two wives and a Before baby mama. Before she calls a third wife for you, the two that are watching no, you I, now. I, I have two. Uh -huh. <laughs> I have two. Uh -huh. Then, the baby mama returned. So there were two. Okay. So ten years after, I was in love with a widow. Okay. okay. So before you know it, we are together. That makes it three. Oh. <laughs> Why are you clapping? Even the women you are clapping. The only, excuse me, the only person that is enjoying polygamy is, is the, the man. man. Not the women. When the women are fighting one another for one man, you you have three. So how do you three? How do you cope? Um, well, how, do, what, um, how do you what's the setup you know, like? Um, in your like home? I said, it's a game of chance. Yes. And there are there are some that maybe God just helped me. Okay. One thing is that they, they should not stay together. Okay, that's uh -huh. what I They are not staying together. Okay. Like one, like in my house now, I have different flats that they are staying. No kitchen together, no parlor together, and if you are a polygamist, you must not be straightforward. Uh uh. Yes, that is the trick. Like a politician. You, yes, you are a politician. <laughs> you must not be straightforward, uh -huh. but you must be faithful to the children. Okay. okay. Yes. You must so be only the children. <laughs> you must. But is it possible? For instance, they say, um, is it possible to like people equally? It's not possible. Exactly. That's why I said, uh, if you are a polygamist, you must be a froster. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Among your wives, you must be a froster. You must learn how to satisfy them. <laughs> so, so it sounds like a lot of, of work. work. And you keep uh, saying it's a game. Yes, it's, it, a, it's your juxta, you know, it's very ironical, a game, but it's a lot of work. You see, in, in initially it's a lot of work, mm -hmm. but before you know it, you'll be used to it. The most important thing is that in polygamy, money is involved. Yes, I can imagine. Money is involved, and once you're able to satisfy them, you have no problem. Maybe, uh, for example now, maybe um, the father of one passed on, you spend money there. Two months after, the other one has something to do with their family. And you now kept quiet. Ah. There will be a problem. Yeah. So that's why I said money is involved. Money is involved and 
the most important thing is to unite the children. Like my it's own impossible. father, my parents, they were single. Okay. That's why I said I got into it by accident. By chance. And I still thank God. I'm, I'm enjoying it. And you, you, should you should be. You should be. I'm enjoying it. I'm not I'm not I'm 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 I want that complete, brother. Because he said something now. Are your children or do you? Yes. How they, many they do are. you have? Um, by the grace of God now, um, I won't count them. They are, they are ten minus one. They are nine. Okay. Okay. And yes. they're united. They, they are, yes. I have some of them in Europe and across the universities in Nigeria. What I do for one, five, one my parents' children must happen to the other. That's how you I see, do I, my I, 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 Listening to you, you are, you are making uh, also polygamy easy. so <laughs> attractive. Yes. You know, yeah. in the sense that uh, you say you, you are married to three women by chance anyway. Yes, uh, and then you, you are not faithful to all of them. You have to, you, you know, pretend in some instances yes. or in most cases that you are treating all of them equally, equally well. when you know that you are not fair to all of them equally. And then now you also think that your children are united. Do you know that women, by nature, are not only conniving, they know when yeah, they are at a disadvantage they do. in yes. a setup. They do. And once they know that, they tend to also co-opt the children, children into letting them know how unfair their father is to her situation. And in that case, the children would always tend to go, you know, towards their mother. Towards towards their mother. Their mother. So how do you now know that the children are also not being, you know, as you, too. politicians as you against as politicians, me, fraud against you? Yes. Um, uh, you know, yeah. as I've said, the main thing there is money. Once you can satisfy the children, like in my house now, they have their apartments, I have mine. When it's time for food, um, there's no timetable for my food. You may, if you bring, to be there. If you bring, to be there. Like three may be there. I may just eat little by little. The children will come near me. We do it together. Sure, you understand. Mm. And there is no way, even in monogamy too, the children tend to be for the mother than the father. So my duty as a father is to satisfy my children and give them the best, which is education and discipline. And I will never encourage them to go into my own plight because I said it's a game of chance and I'm so far so good. God just helped me. It's a risky game. You understand? Okay, so, okay, so I want to ask him a question mm -hmm. now. Yeah. Okay. Um, I, well, what is the relationship like without sex? Okay, so with, I'm with thinking, my wife? is it possible to, to uh, sexually satisfy more than two women? One woman. <laughs> One self. No, no, he has three now. So, so how does he do it? Um, is there like an I said, a timetable? I mean, there is no timetable. Uh -uh. For sex, I'm talking about this. For yeah. food, for recreation, no timetable. <laughs> I may be in your room, maybe around 10 o'clock. Uh -huh. Till 1 o'clock. Mm -hmm. I go back to my room, maybe around five, when the Muslim are they are calling, yes, I, the, yes they are calling for prayer. I may go to another person's room. Hey. You understand? So there is no way you will know. There is no way you will know. Uh, we have been talking to Mr. Bayode Ogunsowo. He has been very, very insightful into coping with polygamy, a polygamist himself, a happy polygamist himself, and a seasoned educationist. Uh, one thing I got from the last bits before we left was that um, he's enjoying his plight. He has called it a plight No, he before. can't enjoy it. Are you he's, saying he's that? He cannot enjoy it. Let me, tell, let me ask this question. Are you saying that your wives don't quarrel? There is no bickering? There's everything is peaceful? There's harmony in your home? How do you... You see, you can't I have say a it's perfect. pattern way of doing it. What is the pattern, like, sir? <laughs> number one... The kitchen, they have separate kitchens, separate sitting rooms, separate apartments. They, have, uh, they all have vehicles. You see, in, in polygamy, you have to be straightforward to them. What you do to A must go to B and maybe C or D. The one, so there's one never been priority. quarrels between your wives? There's never been they, bickering? They, they there's are, never... Um, you see, money... Money is very powerful. It answers all things. So, so are, yes. you, are you a rich man, sir? You must be. Um, 
No. It's comfortable. I, I'm comfortable. Okay. I'm an average man and, and I'm contented with what I have I, and I share it with them equally. Okay. okay. At this point, I'd like to invite her. And, 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 and in addition, I have control over my territory. Oh, that is it. You have to. I have control. total control. You Looking at me, you yes, you, you know, you know the. You even if I'm family. not around, mm. there's no way you will misbehave. Mm -hmm. Because yes, when I come back, you know the consequence. I may uh -uh. tell you. That, go it and sounds report like to your a family. school, though. It's an education. Well, it's an education. Okay, you say there's so consequence for misbehavior. Yes. yes. You are talking about your kids or your wife. Anybody. Uh -huh. Any of them. Anybody. <laughs> uh, um, any, any, any of them. I'd like okay, to invite right someone else to join this um, discussion at this point in time. I'd like to invite um, the Okomiye, <laughs> Stella Moye, to come and join us. Stella. <laughs> <laughs> and I salute you, the audience. Oh. Thank you. My name is Stella Moye. Yeah. Beautiful singer, indeed. Yeah. Uh, all right, then. Um, Thank Stella, you. we're yes. talking about coping with polygamy. Yeah. Okay, you're a happy polygamist. His name is uh, <laughs> Mr. Bayode Ogunso. He's been giving us uh, insights. You, you come from a polygamous setting. Tell us about your own experience. Well, um, I don't think there's anything exciting about polygamy. Um, in the olden days, it was okay because our parents wanted more wives, more children to work for the farms. sake of farms. And they were really not emotionally attached to these women, um, except for, okay, they are my wives, they are there. Okay. But as time went on, polygamy became a forbidden fruit, you know, because the truth is that, the truth is that men are not polygamous in nature. They are insatiable in nature. Mm -hmm. Yes. It is insatiable. I agree you know, with because, you. Because um, they find different reasons to, 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 uh, to name what it is, the game they're playing. You know, they meet a girl, a new girl, and it's like, oh, where have you been in all my life? <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, he has one or two already mm -hmm. that he has sang the same song to. Yeah. You know, and there's no way you can, you can love two, three two people at the same time. Probably. It's impossible. You will like one and love one. You can never love all of them. It's not possible. Yeah, he admitted that now. He admitted it. He admitted it. But he so said it's a political what I'm way saying of is going about the it. women who go into it yes. are no also meaning. as guilty as the men who are, um, who are the architects. Yes, they all have different reasons. Exactly. Yes. So what could be the reason for a woman to go into polygamy? Some of these I, women... Um, I heard him saying something like, money is powerful, yes, blah, it is. blah. Money you know. is power. It so, is. Some, sometimes it is money is part of it. And then sometimes sentiment is part of it. Sometimes out of pity. Maybe the man has spent so much money on her, and everybody is saying, well, you can't go anywhere with this, the way you've gone with this man. And the man also is encouraging her to say, look, what stops you from being my wife? Or it could wife? be sometimes even the woman herself is now desperate. Yes. Maybe your, your biological Thank clock you. is ticking. Is ticking. Or, or, okay. they, or they say uh, in quotes that mm. they fell in love with a man. Yeah, because you know, yeah. Said, a, yeah, I was giving my, my own, um, what do I call it now? Experience. My own experience. Yes. Okay. That I, I, I was in neck deep into polygamy. Okay. You know, born into it, married into, so, yeah. into it, and then ran out from of it. Health 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 health. Health. I ran out of it. Because, you see, polygamy to me, should not be encouraged, should not even be practiced at all. At all. Because it is, it is not only stressful for the man, even for the women who are involved. It is a lot of, uh, how do you say it, um, a lot of intrigues yeah. go into so it. And many, it's uh, too many... Too many games. Too many games, too many complications. Way, yes. Some and if you really don't want fetish. at all yeah. to compete for the man's heart yes. and for the man's attention. The fact that they have different flats, yes. Mr. ogun Sanwo, is not a solution to the, to the fact the that yeah. three women are sharing one man. Mm. And you yes. know that, yes. you know, um, <laughs> relationship is very, you are protective of your relationship. Yes. You guard it. You, 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 you protect it with your all. And if, if you see another woman also interested 
in the man you are interested in. You, 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 you go out of your way. Yes. You go out of your way. And, and the funniest part is that some of these yeah. men, some of these men are not real. You know, that's it. Some of the men, the men who practice polygamy, this, uh, this, 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 are not rich. Um, yes, the women are not rich. If I may come in, they are not rich. Please. Yes, let me. Um, there are some men that are fooling themselves. It's very common. They will have a wife at home and a girlfriend, and another wife outside. outside. They will set another home for them outside. Yes. Yeah. Their future will be in red with time. If you are with your wife, why, why can't you be faithful than trying another thing outside? outside. So, with that, tried it, like I said, it's a game of chance, and it has been like that. And I, I would never pray for my child to try it. it. But in my own case, um, God has been helping me so far so good. It's a, game, it's a, it's a brain work, like I said. <laughs> isn't, yes. that, isn't that stressful? And, and, and no, it's asking, right? Isn't this it's, stressful? It, it, initially, it, it is. But once you get used to it... Would you do it again, Mr. If myself? You, yes. If you could do like, yes. yes. like, like my, my son in Europe, I did the naming... Um, last November, and I announced that that will be my last. Mm. I announced to the public. He's, he's answered your question, actually. He said that if he was to come back again, he would he not wouldn't try it. It's, okay. it's brain work. Yes. He has which, answered which, it. Which means the answer is that it's not okay. It's not okay. Yeah. Once you do something for one, you must do for the other. Like, if I want to change their vehicle, yes. it must be in the space of one month. All of them. Yes. If you want to change the furniture in the sitting room, you have to do it at the same time. Ah, but some men are daring. They will change one. They won't change the rest. Yes. You see, All such of you men, will be and they such won't, men they won't... will not prosper. You think so? Yes, they will if not they prosper. prosper. If you are not straightforward, <laughs> they will not. No. It's, it's a matter of time. An average man must be straightforward. 